Hello everyone. Uh, today I'm going to show you the fix. Uh, multiple projects uh, in a solution were not loaded. Uh, that type of error. That is one or more projects in the solution were not loaded correctly. This types of error how to fix in the .NET Core. And uh, there is SMS.Web is not uh, actually uh, loaded in successfully. So first of all, modify your Visual Studio because uh, updates are available. Uh, so update your Visual Studio like uh, uh, not uh, available total space 3.54 GB that alert marks so just remove the applications like uh, universal Windows platform development because uh, I'm not working uh, right now so uh, removed it and install uh, the updates as well so this is the simple thing you can do uh, in in this type of error uh, to fix that type of error because uh, if you want uh, if you if if you will repair your Visual Studio then uh, that type of problem will solved easily. So Visual Studio Professional 2017 uh, actually I'm currently working and currently using. So uh, before we get that type of uh, error because total number of space are not required uh, not uh, available in my uh, disk. So remove uh, Windows platform and just uh, update your Visual Studio. And after that your uh, Visual Studio will update 15.8.5 uh, then you open your sms.pap.your uh, previous applications successfully okay that is uh, not uh, doing correctly successfully so update your visual studio okay if you uh, if you want to install another enterprise applications uh, then is there is no need so first of all uh, modify your uh, visual studio 2017 and update your visual studio it's must to update your visual studio remember that update your visual studio to resolve that types of problem only so uh, total space required to remove there is minus uh, 4829 there is uh, enough and modify it and update it must to update your visual studio there is a uh, requirement of uh, requirement of this type of, of error to fix it okay uh, so cut uh, that uh, downloading and uh, just jump to uh, the sections where your visual studio will update it successfully so the previous version is 15.8 point something so the current version ill you can check Yeah, current version is 15.9.7 so launch it and uh, just open your file just simply update your visual studio and uh, your uh, you can say recover your visual studio and open your application thank you very much for watching this video